Hi everybody, I'm right in the middle of putting my... I'm using a BB cream tonight. I thought I would uh, try this. I moved my tripod down quite a bit so you can actually see me putting my makeup on today. Put you out just a little bit more, I think. Is that better? You're gonna have to tell me how you how this was. I'm going out to dinner with my my mom and my uncle Larry and his son Jason, um, who has Downs, so he lives with him, Down syndrome. <coughs> Excuse me, here I go. And um, my cousin Sharon, and her husband is out of town. He, it's Larry's other, Larry's um, daughter, and her husband is out of town at a pool tournament. So she's going with us. So it's going to be a fun Saturday night. I mean, we're just going out to dinner. I mean, I'll come straight home after, and uh, I think I'm going to go do laundry tonight, but. Does anybody else have to go to the laundromat and absolutely hate it? I have bought. Oh, there's a. I have bought um, new underwear, so I wouldn't have to go to to the or to the laundromat. That's how bad I hate it. There is nothing I hate worse than having to take my clothes to a laundromat and sit there and uh, have to wait on other people to, you know, for um, to get done with the dryers or, you know, they've only got uh, four of the big washers, which I have to use. I wait so long. I only do my laundry about once a month. <laughs> so... That's how bad I hate it. All right, that should be it for my for that anyway. And it is it did even out my color a lot. I was very red faced when I first started. So uh, I was going to start this, and then I just totally forgot about it. So, but this looks like it's going to work really well um, for get ready with me at this height. You're going to have to tell me how much, if you like it better or not. Because it seems to work with my mirror. I'm actually turn my makeup mirror on. Alright, so um, I am using my uh, Ulta Brow Tint that I just got. I just hauled it. I'm going to see. Um, I, it does not look to me like it's going to be dark enough. But we're going to see how it works. I should get my, there we go. My dang bangs don't want to cooperate tonight. i just trying to get them out of the way. And I have got one, let's see if I can pull it out of there, that is super long, that drives me nuts. Do I have a, I do. get a hold of the damn thing. Ow! Ow, ow, ow. I don't know how people can pluck their eyebrows. That hurts. Alright, let's see how this works. Yep, you can still see me. Good deal. I'm happy about that. Does anybody else use the tinted brow mascara besides me? I am just not good with an eyebrow pencil and I can make it work with um, with like uh, shadow type stuff but I tell you what I for me I think this works the absolute best 
my eyebrows are never quite right anyway because I'm missing a lot of my eyebrow on this side. And then I just comb them just to even out that color. I think that looks pretty good actually. This one here, is, this eyebrow is just a little bit trickier because I don't have a lot of eyebrow on this side. And there you be. Um, this was a lot better than I thought it was going to be. Okay, eyeshadow. I am going to use the Lorac Pro today that I got, that I won from Brandy Wright. <clears throat> and let's see what colors I'm going to use. I am going to use Fawn for my all over color. I do not go crazy on my eyeshadow just because I'm not very good at it <laughs> and I don't have as much eyebrow or eye, eyebrow eyelid on this side because if you can see I have a scar going across I was um, just I think it was 30 years ago, I was in a car accident where I had 50 stitches in my face. It, my eyelid was cut all the way across. I had um, cut up here. It, this here was a mess up here. This here was bad. Uh, I was sliced all the way across my nose and I had a jagged scar here and the one that you can really see is going across my chin. And this one is the one that causes me problems because I have hair growing out of it now. All right, so what am I going to wear today? Let's go with, I'd like to wear a matte. I am going to, that's a plum color. I thought that was a brown. I am going to go with regular brown and let's just see how that looks. I like to pat it on at first and then kind of windshield wiper it over. Yeah, that's pretty. It's a matte, and that's what I want. Let's do... Let's put a tiny bit of this gold on my finger and just kind of go over my lid a little bit. There, so it just shines it up just a little bit. Kind of defeating the purpose of putting a mat on, aren't I? I think that makes it kind of pretty actually all right that is it for my eyeshadow I'm very just very simple girl okay wipe my brush off before I put it away and kind of clean up the edges here a little bit mascara I am going to use my um that I got in my free case here of from Ulta last week, I'm going to use the mascara. I have not used it yet. I haven't even opened it. I just took the wrapping off right before I started filming. This is what it looks like. So let's just see how it is. And then I forgot to curl my lashes again. I got to get in the habit of doing that. I keep forgetting. And 
And since I'm going with my family, I'm not even going to put any eyeliner on tonight. I usually line my waterline on the bottom. You guys all know that if you watch me for very long. I usually do a dramatic under eye, but I hardly ever put any on the top. Um, this isn't too bad. I mean, it, it coats them pretty good. It just, I don't know. I don't think it volumizes the best, and that's what it is, legendary lengths. Or maybe it's just lengthening and not volumizing. I will write every down, everything I use down in the down bar as normal, as I've been doing anyway. I guess it's not normal. It's my new normal. How's that sound? So I am going to, since I'm not going to do any eyeliner, I'm going to make sure that I get my bottom lashes. And look at that from that mascara already. Yeah. Not impressed already. Where's the wipe I just had? Didn't I just have a wipe? There it is. And that's not the wet one. There it is. You should see my, my makeup desk. It is an absolute disaster. <laughs> Oh, there goes my phone. Sorry, my mother. Confirming when she's going to be here. All right, so I'm going to use my um, Instant Age Rewind um, concealer just a little bit under my eyes. Around my nose. If I can brighten these things up over here a little bit. I don't think it conceals much, but. I'm going to use my beauty blender just a little bit. <sighs> Wipe my fingers off here. Okay. I didn't get any blush out either. Or highlighter, I guess. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, blush. Let's see here. I'm going to use my bodyography. I've been using my new Sonia Kashik um, brushes too. Lighter. Let's see. Let's use Becca. I 
I forget when I'm using these brushes how how um dense they are and I tend to pick up a little bit too much. And then I think it highlights, really highlights my um highlights my wrinkles underneath my eyes. All right, so I'm done with that. Let's do some powder. And I'm going to use my Bodyography powder, pressed powder, too. And I'm just going to do a light dusting of that. Okay, one thing I forgot to do was use my uh, eyelid primer. God dang it. I just realized I forgot to do that. Okay, lipstick. I am going to, I haven't used this for quite a while. It's the Revlon Color Stay Ultimate Liquid Lipstick in, I have no idea, in... Well, I just don't think it tells me a name. Where the hell? Just says liquid lipstick. Wait. Let's get out my trusty little. Okay. It is 030 Miracle Mauve. How about that? I haven't used this for quite a while, so we'll see. liquid lipsticks look at that and I really I have a hard time with them I'm going to use a tissue with this See, it's mat matting up already. All right, folks, that is my makeup for the day. Get my bangs where they're supposed to be. over here. I always got those dang wings in my hair. All right, there it is. For better or worse, my mom's going to tell me I overdid it as usual. But I think it's I think it turned out very pretty actually. I think that um BB cream looks very nice. Um where, what did I do with it? I was going to show you that. It is um, Physician's Formula, actually, Super BB Cream. And it's SPF 30, and it's in the color light. And I think it looks very nice. Feels very nice on my skin. The highlight ended up looking pretty good. Maybe I look better because I don't have a lot of... What do you think? Tell me. Um... I usually use the, the dark eyeliner underneath the gel eyeliner, gel, gel and a pencil eyeliner underneath my, um, on my bottom 
lashes or bo bottom water line I'm sorry so what do you think um, does it look better without it um, should I put a little on top and not on the bottom should I keep doing it on the bottom I think my eyes look very pretty today that color I'm in love with these this color what do you guys think I think it looks very nice all right, that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. I've got, uh, I think, three. One that was posted today, and then I think I've got two more pre-recorded, and then I will post this one after those. So I will talk to you guys very soon. I love you. Bye-bye.